Hey, Sean here from SpeedQReview.com. Today we have another common cube question. What is a parity error? Parity errors are issues where you have pieces like edges that are not lined up to where the cube can be solved in a normal 3x3 method. When solving a 4x4 or a larger cube, at one point you will pair up all the edge pieces so at the end of the solve they act as one giant edge piece like a 3x3. You can run into situations that do not normally occur on a 3x3 and have to do an algorithm to realign specific pieces. For example, if you are solving CFOP or Friedrich method during the OLL stage, you will either have no edges flipped, two of them, or four of them. If you have a parity error on a 4x4, you can have one or three of them oriented correctly. To fix this, you will do this algorithm, which on a 4x4 switch the two edge pieces in the front, causing them to now be oriented correctly. I use the same algorithm on a 5x5 to switch pieces in that same way. After that, there's a chance that some of the edges are not in the correct place for PLL. You cannot have this in any odd number big cues because the center piece in the edges holds that spot. This is a much easier algorithm. Again, there are multiple algorithms you can use and knowing more than one will make your solve faster by possibly avoiding steps following the parity algorithm. This one switches the edges that are opposite each other. Whenever you have an inner slice, you do not have to turn it like I just did. You can just turn two faces 180 degrees, followed by the outer face another 180 degrees. I will often do this just because it's a little bit safer and usually faster to execute. Thank you for watching. Please leave your thoughts and questions in the comment section below. Please like and subscribe for more videos in the future like this, and as always, stop by speedqbview.com for more news and reviews.